Here we are, John XD on scene at the International Mall, the brand new fighter warehouse. This is the store as I come up on it. Um, we are in a perfect location. I mean, we've got Dillard's right down the hallway here. We've got Neiman Marcus, um, Apple Store right over here. This is fighter warehouse, guys. This is where you get all your fight gear. You want gloves, you want pads, you want shirts, you want shorts. It's all here. It's all right here. Come with me for a minute. And everything is here. Everyone is here. Look at who I'm running into. I'm running into Orlando, five-time world champion kickboxer. Um, this is the man. This is this is MMA at his finest. This is this guy's been doing it all his life. This is what he does. Orlando, what brought you out here today? Well, what brought me out here was Isham with his Spider Warehouse. I mean, this is the place to be right now. It's it's growing. You know, as uh, MMA grows, uh, Spider Warehouse is growing alongside with it. And um, I'm here to just support Isham and his family, and uh, you know, spread some love with him and and just show him that I care. And I'm going to send all of my warriors here to get what they need because we wear warrior wear. So, uh, Tell me about your, uh, your next event coming up. When, when are we looking for your next event? Sir, my next event will be September 20th over at the uh, downtown Hilton in St. Pete. And um, we're looking to have uh, a good sellout crowd and there's going to be some good fast action. Uh, amateur kickboxing. It's not MMA, it's amateur kickboxing. they so, got to start somewhere. Yeah, they got to start somewhere, exactly. But these are guys that are looking to make a name for themselves and then come up and, you know, do like RFC next, you know, and go pro no doubt outstanding man that's good to hear that's good to hear because you got to start somewhere um, this place has all the outfits has all the gear if they need to get their gear they want to get some training equipment this is the place uh, there's nothing like this in Tampa Yo, no not this at man, all this man's been around for a long time there's nothing like this anyway, yes sir this is this is revolutionary for the MMA world. No question. And uh, to be here mainstream in this mall right now, in the International Mall, which is, you know, everybody knows in South Tampa how the International Mall is fast and growing. Um, and the same thing is going to happen to uh, Fighters Warehouse. It's fast and growing, just like the sport. There we are. Thank you, Thanks, guys. All right, we got one question I want to ask Chris real quick. Chris, what is your favorite magazine? Favorite magazine of all times, 24-7 magazine. House, John XD, Isham, and Jamie Varner. Um, this is this is a grand opening. This is the first time anything like this has ever been done anywhere in Tampa or Orlando or anywhere. I think in the U.S. In the U. In the U.S. Like there is nothing like this in the U.S. Maybe the world. Planet. planet. Why not? We're we're taking over the planet, Isham. This is uh, one one step at a time. Um, we're going to talk to Jamie a little bit about his last fight because um, you know we we're looking to see what's going on in the MMA world. This is the WEC lightweight champion of the world. This is the man. This is this is what you have to fight at 155. This is the man. So we're going to talk to him a little bit about his last fight and about what he's done. Um, introduce Jamie. Nice. It's a pleasure. Thank you. Um, talk to me, brother. Well, you know, my last fight was... Uh <clears throat> August 3rd against Marcus Hicks. He was a he was a very tough opponent, but uh, I was able to finish a guy that's never been finished before. Eight, he was 8-0, eight oh, undefeated, never been knocked out. He's only had one or two fights that even made it past the second round. So um, I was I was fortunate enough to go into that fight and uh, walk away with the victory. So uh, you know it was, it was a good fight for me. Land some good knees, land a couple right hands, ended up walking away with uh, TKO. And, and successfully defending, of course, his belt. Yes, yes. That is definitely part. the most important. Got to keep that hardware. Exactly. Now, I got another thing a lot of people don't know, or you may not know just yet, but um, Jamie's also a motocross rider. Jamie rides motorcycles, uh, both street and dirt. Um, I do have a question for him. What is more of an adrenaline rush? Walk into that cage or, say, jumping off of uh, what are your 30, 40 foot jumps that you do in your tricks? Uh, you know, I, I've, been, uh, I've been known to clear some 65 footers in my day. Uh, <laughs> you know what? I, uh, I'd have to say get in there and having to fight somebody, go to war, is probably more of an adrenaline rush. You know, fighting's my love, but racing and riding will always be my passion, and I'll be able to do that until the day I die. That's completely understandable. Um, again, we appreciate your, your time. Um, thank you very much for being here. We appreciate it. And uh, we look forward to seeing your next fight when it's coming up. Thanks. All right, guys, tell me one thing. What's your favorite magazine? 24-7 magazine. Don't sound so enthusiastic. Come on. Come on. Give me that a little better. Earn, earn it. Earn it. 24-7 magazine. There. That's better. Thank you. One more quick question for Jamie. Uh, what, what, what magazine are you checking out here? Uh, 24-7. It looks like a local magazine. And I, uh, I'm recognizing a couple of girls I've seen here from last night. So uh, I'm pretty excited. Oh, my gosh. Look at all this fight. Yeah. 24-7 magazine. you got to check it out. Fighters Warehouse, International Mall. 
All right, here we are on scene at Fighter Warehouse in the International Mall, John XD, Mr. Chris Baden. Um, we are here on open, grand opening day, August 30th, Saturday morning. Um, this is the first time any kind of store like this has been opened in any kind of place like this. We are surrounded by tons and tons of merchandise. Um, Chris, tell me what we got going on here today. That's true, that's true. What you said, there is no store like this any place here in Tampa. Fighter Warehouse, International Plaza, the best place for fight gear, the best place for fight wear. Just look at everything you got here behind me. We got shirts, we got shorts, we got gloves. Anything a fighter needs, everything a fighter needs. If you've, even if you're not a fighter, come down here, grab a t-shirt, grab some shorts, hang out with your family. This is a perfect place for you. One more quick question, uh, Orlando. What magazine do you, do you check out all the time and, and read for your fight updates and for your, your entertainment updates? Oh, of course. 24-7 magazine. I carry it with me all, all the time. And as you can see, I saw one here and I picked up the latest issue. This is the magazine to, to look for your fighters' information and any upcoming fights. This is the place to look, 24-7. Thank you, sir. We got one question for everybody today. Where are we at? Fighters Fighter Warehouse, Warehouse International, International Mall. Mall.